standards. And more recently, I came across one little spark of inspiration that's turned into something that a lot of people have said is uh, really quite good. Well, I'd like to share it with you now. It's a look at it's a look at some of the events of the year, that most memorable year, 1066, from the point of view of the Norsemen. So I give to you Andrada's last stand. A land now in chaos, a crown that was pledged, or so Harold Godwin sent fiercely alleged. With King Edward dead, he now walks the knife edge and proclaims England's rule as his own. But Harold Hadrada stands not for this claim. The crown by a treaty belongs to his name. And so we have gathered our hearts all aflame. We nor come to take England's throne. Away, away from our homes to the fray. We battle for King Edward's land. And all that I pray is remember this day, the day of Hadrada's last stand. Wolford hot rather dispatched through their lines. The Saxons all killed within narrow confines, and those that remained all did swear to align with fierce herald that praise him as Lord. But trust not the Saxons, their words were but lies. They lured forth hot rather towards actions unwise. For at Bridge of Stamford we claim not our prize, but our fate at the end of their swords. Away, away from our homes to the fray, we battled for King Edward's land. And all that I pray is remember this day, the day of Hadrada's last stand. Full two-thirds the army remains in the west, our burnies cast off only shields at best. And now God with the sun puts our strength to the test, with his two stars prepared to engage. But one of our right hands is feet firm and strong, defending the bridge against the mad Saxon throng. His great sacrifice will be passed down in song as we now enter fierce battle's rage. Away, away from our homes to the fray, we battled for King Edward's land. And all that I pray is remember this day, the day of Hadrada's last stand. Now all that remains is a sea of bright red, our camp slain by arrow, our blood all quite shed. Earl Tostig and great Eystein or Eli dead, we make for Valhalla this night. But mourn not our passing and shed not a tear, for Norsemen in battle they never know fear. So pass on the tales of our deeds through the ears and remember Hadrada's last fight. Away, away from our homes to the fray, we battle for King Edward's land. And all that I pray is remember this day, the day of Hadrada's last stand. Yes, all that I pray is remember this day, the day of our brother's last stand. So when I was uh, first uh, learning some songs, I started looking at some of the uh, older songs from the early, early days of Tom here. I found some of these are really, really fun, and we don't hear these. I don't know why. So, with that said, the skulls arise from chivalry, drink one last toast to gallantry, then join the king in chivalry to march against the foe. Fear and take your spear in hand, let every able fight to stand to guard the honor of our land. To battle we must go. Raise your eyes to the skies where the golden falcon flies, singing out our battle cries to fill the foe with fear. Your shield, cry, advance, and never yield. Descending on that glorious field, is none the gallant hero. In olden days, you won an all in answer to the warrior's call. Did sally forth from Worth and Hall, the enemies of face. You bravely served the middle crown, and by your deeds, you won renown as many foes. You battered down with that to bloody mace. Raise your eyes to the skies where the golden falcon fights, screaming out her battle cries to fill the foe with fear. Oh, don your helm and raise the shield, cry advance and never yield, descending on a glorious field of this time by Calendero. Raise up a flag for all to see the symbol of our sovereignty, and let them know we bend on each and no man but our king. It's the time for war again in the year, the enemy. So let them hear the 
Here. 